Happy Thursday, everyone! Today, we caught up with the varsity throwers and talked with one person in particular about how their season is going so far. I'm Kara, and this is SVTV. will have their laptop check-in starting the 15th and the underclassmen will have theirs the following week. Check Schoology to see what you have to do before you check in. Speaking of seniors, if you are taking the AP exam, make sure to create your student account. If you are 16 and still haven't picked up your fishing license, there are still some free ones available. See Mrs. Popescu if you want one. There will be, there will be a Stuff the Bus fundraiser where you gather school supplies for the Boys and Girls Club. Please participate because the seminars that meet their quota gets put in a drawing for a pizza party. There will be a contest to name the blended learning spaces. Deadline to email your ideas to Mr. Tinsley is May 11th. Spanish Club will have a Latin dance workshop during seminar this Friday. Pre-register in W20 by this Thursday. After this quick commercial break, we will go see what's inside the world of Seaman Viking Sports. SUCO will be sponsoring an event called Stuff the Bus, where each seminar will be assigned a different supply this week from May 7th to 11th. Supplies include erasers, notebooks, crowns, and many more. All this will benefit the Boys and Girls Club, so be sure to donate supplies and help people in need. Do you enjoy fishing? Are you 16 or older? Then sign up for a fishing license with Mrs. Popescu in room 927. They are free for students and teachers, but there are only 20 left, so get yours today. If you're looking to stay in shape over the summer, pick up a foreign in Miss Schaefer's room. Last week, we talked about Mitch Miller breaking the school's discus record. League track is going on today, so let's see what their goals are. Up, up, up. Yep, 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 there it was. Uh, I think Mitchell is ranked number one in the state in 5A, so he'd also be number one in league and, and also regionals and city. Our two girls are able to, you know, throw to their full potential. They should be able to place in the city. League's going to be tough. Probably our toughest meet of the year is going to be league. And then regionals, if they do well, they should both make state. League and further will be pretty good for us. All of us are doing really well um, in practice so far. We've all been really trying to work hard to hit PRs for state, and I think it's going to be really good for us. So he should do a, uh, have a pretty good opportunity there to win all of those in place at state. Shot put is another story. He's uh, working on it, and hopefully he's top four in city, top five or so and, uh, in league, and then we'll move on from there. One of the throwers in particular have had an amazing season. Mitch Miller, a senior at Seaman High School, is one of the best throwers in the state. Mitch has high expectations for the rest of the season. Hopefully winning discus because I'm ranked first in 5A at the moment. So uh, hopefully the goal is just to get to state and do well at state. Mitch recently broke the school's discus record. Mitch is planning to go to Washburn University to continue his throwing career, and the whole team is working to accomplish their goals for the rest of the season. Congrats to Mitch for working very hard to break that record, and good luck to everyone at the meet. Speaking of league, girls swim and dive compete today, and girls soccer have a game at Blue Valley too. It's been pretty warm the past few days. Let's see if Kansas is going to surprise us and have it be in the 40s next week. What's going on, Vikes? It is currently 88 degrees, and tonight it will actually get a little cooler with a little bit of sun, too. And for a three-day forecast, you have highs in the almost the 100s and lows in the 70s, and you'll have a little bit of cloud cover Sunday. And today in history is the Martinez Twins birthday, and it's National Clean Your Room Day. Now let's head back over to me. 
you play God of War, please come see Mr. DeLeonardo if you want to be in a news story. Now that's it for now, everyone. We will catch you right back here tomorrow.